Performance issues are not really that serious. In fact, you may be able to fix them by doing one or a couple of procedures. If you're one of the users who have encountered such a problem after the update, continue watching as we may be able to help you. In this video, we will show you what to do if your Galaxy S21 starts to keep lagging after the Android 12 update. First solution, close background apps. Perhaps the reason why your phone keeps lagging is because there are already a lot of apps running in the background. So the first thing you should do is close them and see if that fixes the problem. Here's how. Tap the recent apps key to view apps running in the background. Swipe up on each app to close them, or you can simply tap close all to quit them all at once. After closing the background apps, move on to the next solution. Second solution, force restart your phone. While the first solution might help your phone run a little smoother, it's better to also refresh your phone's memory by doing the forced restart. It will also reload all core services. Here's how you do it. Press and hold the volume down button and the power key for 10 seconds. This will force your device to shut down and power back up. When the logo shows, release both keys and wait until the reboot is finished. Once the restart is complete, observe your phone closely to see if the lags are gone. Third solution, reset all the settings on your phone. Another possibility is that the problem can be due to some settings. You may have changed something that caused the phone to lag. So to rule it out, you have to reset all the settings on your device. It's effective but none of your files or data will be deleted. Here's how it's done. Swipe down from the top of the screen and then tap the settings icon. Find and tap General Management. Touch Reset. Tap Reset All Settings. Tap the Reset Settings button. If prompted, enter your PIN, password or pattern. Tap Reset. Once the phone is ready, try to see if it still lags or if the problem is already fixed. Fourth Solution, Factory Reset Your Phone. If the previous solutions haven't fixed the problem, then it's time to reset your phone. Firmware-related issues can always be fixed with a reset. However, you will have to create a backup of your important files and data as they will be deleted. When ready, follow either of the guides below so you'll be guided accordingly. Swipe down from the top of the screen and then tap the settings icon. Find and tap General Management. Touch Reset. Tap Factory Data Reset. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen and tap Reset. If prompted, enter your PIN, password or pattern. Tap Delete All. Now enter your password and then tap Done to finally reset your device. After the reset, set up your phone as a new device. The problem should be fixed now. We hope that we've been able to help you one way or the other. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.